Hi, I'm State Representative Sarah Wojcicki Jimenez, and we just finished up another task force meeting here in the House looking at sexual harassment and discrimination. Today's guests included um, some folks from the governor's office as well as the Department of Human Rights. And part of what we're continuing to try to learn is what are the current processes. And we've mainly looked at the executive branch so far and kind of learning about what their complaint intake is, how long it takes for victims. One of the things that uh, we learned, and I'm going to try to get this information posted up on the website, is the number of complaints that come in through the Human Rights Department. And, you know, those can vary from sexual discrimination to housing to race issues, how those are handled at the department, and then they actually, after that, can go on to a commission process. One of the things we heard today, though, is that there is a very long time period, potentially for a victim. One of the folks here today said that it could take up to seven years from intake to a, a final determination through those processes. And I think um, part of what I've been trying to do is look at this process from the victim's perspective, because that's been one of the, the challenges I hear from victims um, across the state and as I talk to them is that they're not really confident in the process. And so we're continuing to try to learn best practices in this area and hope to implement them um, as changes in reform if it makes sense and, and the task force members agree. So we're going to be having another task force meeting come up probably in the next couple of weeks while we're in Springfield and we'll keep you posted on uh, those happenings.